Hi, Taurus. How are you? This is your reading for the week of October 9th to the 15th. And I am doing the Master Mason spread for you, okay? I'm trying to be as I'm being as calm as possible. I've been reading all day, to be honest, but I had to, to take a break and um, take care of some stuff, okay? So let's see what's going on with you, Taurus. Please know, I hope that your health is okay. I always make sure I ask that because I always set, get, uh, um, what do you call it? Health stuff for you all the time. I don't know why. All right, so Taurus, Sun, Moon, and Rising for October 9th to October 15th, 2017, Taurus. Let's see what's happening for you. You are the second to last reading that I am doing today. <laughs> all right, Taurus, uh, let's see what's going on. What are you asking about this week? You have the Ace of Swords. So you got a new idea that you may be, that you're trying to offer people or somebody else is trying to offer you a new idea as to how to approach something. It could be something involving your health, uh, new ideas. It could be any damn thing, to be honest, but you're dealing with a situation where you can't, you can't decide. You can't, I feel like somebody's trying to choose what kind of treatment that they want to do here. So if somebody's trying to say, you know, go with that treatment is cheaper. Um, you know, it's, it's less on your body. It's, it's uh, you know, you, you'll recover faster. It, it feels like a doctor visit that you're taking, or you're just in general, you're getting information about some sort of treatment or procedure or whatever it is. It doesn't have to be in a doctor's office. It could just be an approach to something, a new approach to something or some one that you're dealing with here okay what's helping you solve this is the ace of cups so you have a new relationship that may um you have a very supportive this does not have to be a female that you're seeing this this ace of cups is just a new beginning a new life uh, a new love that you met you could have met someone in the hospital you could have met a partner. You could have met someone. Um, it could have been a nurse. It could have been an EMT that you feel like that person was kind of attractive for some reason. They're, they're helping you out, like whoever they are. It doesn't have to be someone that you spend your life with or a soulmate. It could be soulmate energy, you know, or a twin flame energy that you met that they're trying to help you do something or they're being very supportive of, of whatever change that you want to make for yourself they're being very supportive of that because i was getting procedures here so they may be the ones that are giving you ideas as to what to do about a procedure or they're giving you this could like i said it could be a nurse or an emt that you're interacting with they're trying to give you options you have someone who's trying to give you options for your health or and options in general or you have options these new these two aces here together is like i i have new options you know, I have, I have options in love. I have options for my health, you know, because because of this new beginning or this new person. They're, they're helping you. Whoever this energy is, could be a Cancer Scorpio Pisces person that you're interacting with. They're helping you. They're helping you out. You know, be thankful is the feeling that I get. They're helping you decide something. They're helping you, you know, break down whatever idea you have already. They're trying to say, okay, I, 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 I have an alternative for you. I have an alternative. Don't worry. The negative energy working against the situation, like I just said, is the two of swords. So you, it's, it's tough. You know, it could be a procedure. It could be a relationship, a person. It's tough to make this decision. You want to go with the one, whatever it is, you want to go with the one that's less expensive, that's, that's less harmful, whatever it is, the one that you can recover from, you know, the one that you can recover from quickly. You know what I mean? Like you want it to be cheap cheaper and less on you, whatever it is. It could be a gift for a person. You know, you want the cheaper gift. It could be you're trying to buy something for your girlfriend, your boyfriend, and, and you want to go with the less expensive gift or the less expensive uh, apartment or place to move into here with the two of swords and the ace of swords energy. So it's kind of like, you know, you know, which one is better? Do you like the purple one? Do you like the pink one? Uh, do you like this, the taller one, the shorter one? It could be a guy that's looking at two females. You know, it could be you're looking at two female energies. This is a two of swords energy. It could be air-like energy. You're trying to decide between a Libra. You could be to try, be trying to decide between a water sign and a and a, 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 a air sign energy. If you're a dude, it could be an air sign and a water sign female. You're trying to figure out, you know, what what's the best approach? You know, it could be that you have children with both of these people 
or you've been with both of these people before, but there's the choice that needs to be made in general between them. They may be bickering with each other. Like this two of swords, this two, they could like be identical. Like they, this could be a guy that has seen or has dated women that they look the same. It could be two Hispanic women or two black women, you know, two dark skinned women or two light skinned women, but something about these two women, like they look the same. I don't know. They look similar to each other, almost like they, they're clones or somebody has twins or someone is pregnant with twins. I don't know. So it could be like someone could literally be pregnant with twins. What procedure, you know, should I do a, a C-section? Should I do, you know, should I, I don't, I, you know, natural birth may not be an option for somebody. So if you're expecting a child, you know, that may not, I don't know, for some reason, somebody is, is giving birth pre prematurely and it may be twins. You know, somebody's fighting for who's going to be born first. <laughs> if you're pregnant, you know, you're finding out that you're pregnant and it's because of this new relationship, you impregnated somebody or you are that pregnant female or you're trying to do, you're trying to do some type of procedure that's going to get you pregnant with twins if you are a female. Interesting. What's the advice that's being given from you, given to you, I mean, is from the King of Swords. So you have an air sign male that you are dealing with, a Libra, could be a Libra man that you're interacting with, air sign man, whoever the air sign man is, they may be darker in tone, or you are darker in tone in general, that could also be you. Um, advice given in the sense that this could be someone who lives with you. This could be an uncle. This could actually be a father that's trying to make you decide, you know, what, what do you want to do? Who do you want to be with? Who do you want to have kids with? How do you want to deliver your children? How, what procedure do you want? Do you want to have an operation to remove something? Somebody's trying to get you to, you got a new relationship. Somebody's trying to get you to make choices very, very fast. Very, very fast. You need to be quick on your feet though. In terms of your mind and your thinking, you need to be very quick on your feet. Somebody is 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 not playing games. <clears throat> this air sign man is not playing games in general. The most recent issue, you have the ace of pentacles. So your most recent issue was a new job. It could literally be a new job or a new opportunity, but for some reason it's an issue. Maybe you're not getting along with people. You, you could be not getting along with an earth sign, another earth sign in the environment. And that may be why you're going to this air like this air sign person for advice. What to do? You're trying to figure out what to do about them. Like I said, like you want to that you feel like you're, you're questioning what to do about somebody because either like they have eyes on somebody that you want or they've been flirting with someone that you want. And it's like it's whatever it is, is bothering you. It's bothering you. Somebody's flirting with somebody else in the workplace, wherever, at a bar, wherever. You, if you're out, you're not liking it. If you're trying to get closer to somebody, but somebody else is like trying to take that person away from you. You know, I'm getting sweet talking. You may be trying to sweet talk somebody into doing something for you. What answers you have, you have the sign of Virgo. So you may be asking a Virgo for help you know, uh, a Virgo energy, or you need spiritual interest, introspection. You may be praying a lot. You may be praying for what you want. In general, it could be in love. It could be you want your job to be better and you're praying for it. If you want to look at it that way, if it's a person, if it's you, you know, you need to go to a doctor or somebody else is trying to figure out what procedure that they want to do. You're praying about it. You know, you're being wholesome and you're praying about it, or you're praying about, you know, who am I supposed to be with? I don't want to be in between these two bickering clone like sleep females or males anymore. I want to be able to just be, just be with who I want to be with. You know what I mean? Who do I want to be with here? So it kind of feels like you could be a guy surrounded by a lot of females. This would be your father that's trying to give you insight. If it's a workplace situation, you may be attracted to somebody in the workplace. This person is trying to give you insight in the workplace environment, workplace environment advice. Home advice, this could be your dad, this could be a brother, a priest, a pastor, someone who has a lot of good ideas. You know, they got a therapist, a psychologist, someone who has a lot of good ideas for you as to what to do about a new love, about a new job. You know, what to do about a new job, how to be better. You know, someone could be teaching you how to be a better person in general here with the hermit card. You know, how to be better. They're helping you, like they're supporting you. This new, this Virgo energy could could be with this Ace of Cups. You could have met this person or 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 renewed some type of relationship with this person, but they're supporting. They're very supportive of you, is what it looks like. 
I'm feeling like you got somebody helping you conceal something. It could be an idea that you have. Like I said, it could be a procedure, a kind of procedure that you're not really sharing with other people or a procedure you had, you're not sharing with other people for some reason. Only this person knows. This person may know and maybe this person knows. So maybe you're only, you're limiting who you tell certain things to is what it looks like. If it has to do with a procedure, if it has to do with feelings you have towards somebody in the workplace environment, you're, you're only sharing it or you're only open enough to share it with only maybe about two, three people. That's it. You're not really being open with how you feel. Like you can't trust everybody is the feeling that I get, especially in the workplace environment. I feel like there's too much nosiness going on. People may be watching you, you may, and you don't even know. The environment has the page of swords. So you have a younger air-like energy here. It could be a younger person to you that you're trying to date, see, or it could be a kid that it could be a nosy child and you feel like, you know, you feel like you need to tiptoe around a child for some reason. Whatever the situation is, somebody is, is trying to shield you from being caught or trying to shield you from, I don't know, somebody could be protecting you from making mistakes or helping you not to make any more mistakes. It could be a, a, a patrol officer. You may have, somebody's got a patrol officer that's trying to make sure, like, are you doing a good job at work? You know, are, are they paying you? Are they being nice? Are you being nice? You're trying. So that's why I said this two of swords could literally be like two people that you're trying to decide from. Or if a patrol officer is trying to help you out, you know, procedure, what do you want to do? You Do you want to meet up on this day? Like, should we still be talking in general? You know, are these meetings still necessary anymore? So you may be saying that to this person or this Virgo energy may be saying that to you, vice versa wise. You got two people here that are trying to help you out or protect you. You know, it could be somebody's got a patrol officer. Somebody's got a patrol officer that's trying to make sure that they remain level headed, <laughs> either in the workplace environment, at home. You know, you got somebody that's trying to help you figure out what procedure you want to do. Could have met somebody in the hospital, the workplace environment that you're attracted to. You know, what's the best way to go here? What should we do? It could be a plan with the Ace of Swords. It could be a plan. Like I said, it could be a procedure to get somebody pregnant. You, yourself, you're a female, or you're trying to get your female energy pregnant. If you're tied to a female that you like, that you want to date. You're asking this person, what the hell should I do? How to how do I get to him or her? How do I get him uh, how do I get her pregnant? What do I do? What do I need to do? If you want to start a family and you're dealing with someone who has who has difficulty getting pregnant or conceiving, you want to go with twins. Like if somebody's having difficulty, you want to go double, like Mariah Carey. You know, she was up in age, so she had to do she had to do twins, you know. So it could be a procedure of any kind, you know, it could be a, some type of replacement, uh, needing to replace somebody in the workplace environment. This person has answers. They're going to be help. They're going to help you do something. I'm getting that something is unscrupulous in nature. So whether this person's trying to help you, it's like they are, it's like trying to help you at the same time, but they're helping you do something that's crazy in general. This person too, this Virgo. Virgo energy is hiding secrets. Like they're hiding secrets. This air-like energy here may be helping you figure out why or what this person has been hiding. I'm getting like truth. You know, somebody holds the truth to a situation and it could be about a procedure. It could be something went wrong with a procedure. And that could be this person has answers as to like, what's missing? You know, like, what's happening here? Like, why can't, you know, what's happening inside of my body? Somebody's got answers to this situation though. All right. Let's look to see what the outcome is. If it's a new beginning, if it's a new relationship, uh, somebody's got advice for you as to how to get closer to someone, how to get somebody else out the way so you can get closer to that individual. But let's see the outcome is for you, Taurus. All right. So your outcome has the hangman. So this is like not knowing what to do. Uh, it could have been about a passing of a person or you don't know what to do in general about a procedure. Uh, uh, something is going to be less. What is what is more or less expensive? You know, what is going to be less? 
you know, am I going to be, am I going to heal fast? How long am I going to stay in the hospital? How long am I going to stay with this person? Or how long is this person going to, how much longer is someone going to be somewhere? You may be questioning that about yourself. How long am I, how long am I going to last in this workplace environment if people keep disagreeing with me or my style? Our parents are coming to me and they're complaining. Or children are coming to me and they're complaining, they're crying, they're screaming. You may be getting screamed at. I don't know what the deal is. But somebody's going to help you. So you got people around you that are supporting you. You know, it could be a relationship that you go home to that, that you get you get advice from a lot of people is what it looks like. It's a new relationship that you're getting advice from too as well. Not only this man, not only this air sign man, they hold truth though. Whatever it is, they hold truth. It could be a doctor, it could be a father. You know, it could be a father is telling you if you're a son and your father or a daughter, your father is or your uncle or whoever is telling you a lot about your past or your childhood that you didn't know. But the way you move now as an adult, it has a lot to do with what this, you know, secrets, family secrets or something. It could be your health. You know, as a child, what do you eat? What something that happened to you as a kid? This person has answers. Mystical, it's mystical in nature, whatever it is. Interesting. Wow. Very interesting. All right, Taurus, so that concludes your reading. Um, let me know how it resonates with you and take care. Peace. Bye.